Hello. Um, I have a few minutes while my husband is watching the baby, so I wanted to jump on here and um, talk about the compensation plan really quick for a few minutes because there are a few people who have uh, expressed some concerns about not knowing the details. Um, I did get this brand new brochure in my last order from Biloxi to show me the money, and it's awesome. So. Um, I need to check and see. I think they're, I'm sure they're being offered now, um, if this is what got put in my order. Um, but it breaks stuff down really, really well. But there's just a few little, um, things about the compensation plan that some people, some new people especially, have gotten confused on. So I just wanted to make a note of that for you guys. So, what does it mean to be commission qualified? The only retirement, or the only requirement of the company is to do your $100 of volume. That can be either you purchasing product through your own website or sales coming into your website. Now, remember, purchase price and personal volume are two different things. I believe for a slam and accelerator combo that I'm going to be taking myself wholesale, I think the personal volume that I earn commissions on for that is only $80. Um, so you guys need to make sure to pay attention to that, and we do have a price list. If it's not in the file section, I'll see if I can get it uploaded to the file section. Pay attention to what your PV is, because you need to have that $100 worth of PV to be qualified. Um, if you get one preferred customer that orders that combo from your site, that's usually 90 of PV that's going to be on there. So you still need 10 more dollars to be um, qualified for the month. Now. Once you do that $100, you are then qualified to earn commissions. That first 100 is just the, one, the requirement from the company so that you can earn commissions, be qualified to earn a paycheck. $100 to $499, you're going to make 15% back on that. Okay? $500 and over, you are going to make 25% back on. But remember, that first hundred doesn't count. It counts because it gets you commission qualified. But say you were to have $110 of PV, you're going to earn 15% back of the $10 because the first hundred got you qualified. So um, a lot of people are confused about calculating. They think their check is going to be one thing um, and it's really something else. So um, if you have questions about that, after I post this video, go to the comment section and you can ask me some more clarifying questions. Another thing that has come up is, yes, there's a $2.95 administration fee. No big deal. It's to cover um, banking costs. Um, Plexus has to pay a lot of banking fees, whether you're getting direct deposit or not. Um, so that's just to help cover. It's not per ambassador, it is just $2.95 that comes out of your big commission check on the 15th. Now, you're brand new, you did a little bit of sales, you thought a commission check was coming. Maybe it was supposed to, but if it was less than $10, they hold it in your account and it rolls over to the next month. So that's another little um, discrepancy, not discrepancy, another little detail of the company plan that a lot of people get confused about. If it's a very small amount, it then will roll over to your next paycheck, which it's still there, it counts, but it will get sent out to you on that next pay period. Um, if you have not signed up for direct deposit, your check will get mailed to you. A lot of people are confused on the 15th. They're waiting for that money to hit the bank immediately. On the 15th, when commissions post in our back office, um, you can see what your check is going to be. Depending on the institution, it can take up to two days to actually post into your bank. And if you don't, haven't gone into your back office under profile and updated your banking information and signed up for direct deposit, you're actually going to get a check mailed to you that, that will get mailed out on the 15th. So however long it takes for the mail to get there, it'll take for you to get your check. Now, um, pay points your first month. This is another question that's come up. If you enroll a new ambassador <clears throat> and they order a welcome pack, you do not get paid any commissions on welcome packs. 
However, if you buy a welcome pack, say you just buy the $99 welcome pack, and that's your $99 just for your products that you got at a discount, if you do $100 worth of sales over your welcome pack, that will get you qualified for the month. And so anything after that, you can earn commissions on. Just remember, the welcome pack doesn't count, and you still have to do that first $100 to get you qualified. So if you have a $99 welcome pack and do $100 of sales, it could look like you have $199, $200 of volume, and you might be expecting a check where you actually will not get a check because the welcome pack doesn't count and that first hundred above the welcome pack gets you qualified. Now anything over that you are qualified to get the either 15 or or 25 percent back on and I will tell you I have lots of ambassadors who are doing that on a regular basis doing hundreds of dollars over that. Now if they do their hundred dollars of volume over their welcome pack they then will count pay points for you that month. If they don't, if they just purchase a welcome pack, say they just purchased a welcome pack in April, you'll get your business building bonus on them in April, and then in May, they will count as pay points for you, the five points for being on your first level or whatever level um, you're looking at. So if they sign up, get a welcome pack, do $100 over that welcome pack, then yes, you will get to count them for pay points that same month that you got paid the business building, building bonus on. Um, there was a little bit of a confusion about the fast start. There is no fast start to silver. Um, it's fast start, go for gold in 30 days, and they will double your silver bonus as well as your gold bonus. So silver is 100, so it would be 200, and gold is 250. So 250 doubled is 500. So it's a total of $700 that you can get if you get 20 ambassadors um, on your first three levels in that first 30 days. That's the fast start gold for gold. You have to skip over, go for gold, and then your silver and your gold bonuses are doubled. Um, I'm looking at this brochure to see if there's anything else. Um, the levels, your rank, the levels that you get paid on, when you're an ambassador and you sign up, you just get paid on your first level. When you sign two ambassadors, you're gonna get paid levels one through three. When you sign your third, you become silver, and that's going to get you, you're going to be able to earn commissions on people five levels down. Um, when you make senior gold, that's going to be 250 pay points. You're going to get paid down through six levels. And then in order to get paid that full seven levels of our compensation plan, you need to get your Ruby promotion, which is going to be 500 pay points um, under you. And then, of course, senior Ruby is 750. You're still going to get paid seven levels. Um, Emerald is the 1,500 points. Sapphire is 3,000, and Diamond uh, is 4,500. So I think that's it from there, and there's also the um, achievement bonuses that go with those. I hope that clears up some confusion with those kind of little nuances that um, can be a little bit confusing and that people might not get right off the bat when they first sign up. So I hope that clears things up. If you have any questions, um, leave it down here in the comment section and I will get back to you. I hope you have a fabulous Thursday.